welcome back to my channel so today i'm back with another haul video i just finished getting ready and i am in my robe right now as you guys can obviously tell I basically wear robes around the house all day long every single day because it's just so much comfier but i thought right now would actually be the perfect time to film this haul video because i have a huge parcel here from white fox boutique i did actually open this package um last week and i got content in one of the dresses but I am going to get some more content for them today. So I thought now would be the perfect time to show you guys everything that I did pick up. Okay, I actually just finished filming this video, but I'm going to intervene because I forgot to mention that I do have a code with White Fox, which I always leave all the details of like codes and stuff that I have down below anyway. But it is just Tasha all in capitals. And I believe that gives you, that gives you guys what? Um, I believe that gives you guys 15% off site wide. So I will leave all the details on the screen as well as down below. I have so much stuff to get through though. So I'm just going to get straight into it. I think I'm going to start off with the jeans that I got because I think I got like three or four pairs and they're very bulky. So I think I'll just get them out of the way first. Alrighty, so the first pair of jeans I got are these ones right here. The first three jeans that I'm showing you guys are basically the definition of same, same, but different. You can never have too many jeans though. I feel like everything kind of has like a different fit. Yeah, I did get three very similar looking jeans, but you guys will kind of see when I have them on. They are a little bit different. Anyway, so I got these high-waisted pair of, I think they're kind of like mum jeans. Um, I really love all of the distressing at the front. And I also really like how the distressing isn't like very white, if that makes sense. Like sometimes the like ripped part of jeans is like super white, but I kind of like that this is like, nude it kind of makes them look a little bit more like vintage in a way i don't know maybe that's just me I have rips kind of all over on both sides and then the bottom has like a cut off frayed look i picked these ones up in a size small i do like to get a size small when it comes to white fox's jeans just because i like a little bit more of a baggier fit rather than like a tight fit around my waist so yeah, I just find that smalls fit me better when it comes to white fox jeans. Um, but yeah, these ones are like a high-waisted one. I think these would actually look really cute as like a low-waist pair of jeans as well. If you wanted, you could even get like a size up. Like I could have got a size 10 and then wore it a little bit lower waist. But yeah, I definitely love like the vintage -y look of these jeans and I am excited to try them on. I'm pretty sure most of my jeans that I wear are from white fox. I have so many pairs of jeans from them next up we kind of have like a similar looking jean except this one doesn't have any cuts at the front um and then on the back it just has one under the bum on the one side so yeah they, they are like similar ish i'd say these ones are probably a little bit baggier they are still high waisted though but yeah it's a similar kind of look i guess again i picked these ones up in a size small i am a little bit worried that these are going to be too long on me i am five foot five or 165 or 164 or something centimeters for reference but yeah i'm excited to try them on we'll kind of see how those look i think a lot of the tops that i got are kind of tops that you would wear with jeans so i wanted to get a few different pairs of jeans to kind of mix and match things next up i got these pair of jeans right here which are kind of similar again to the last ones that i showed you guys they're just a little bit more of like a different um <coughs> fuck I guess they're just like a different wash. So these ones are a little bit of a darker blue than the other ones. With darker blue jeans, I typically like to wear like black tops with it or black bodysuits. So yeah, I picked these ones up. Again, there's no kind of like cuts or anything on the front. Then the back just has two cuts instead of the one. And it has a bit more of like a distressed look than the other ones. If you guys can kind of see there. Um, but yeah, again, this look really nice with like a black bodysuit or a black corset or... Um, yeah, just like a black top. That's kind of what I would wear with this one. Those were the blue jeans that I picked up. And then I also got a darker acid wash pair, which I think these are, yeah, they're the exact same as the other jeans. Well, the last jeans are the, the, the same as the last pair of jeans that I showed you guys. But these ones are just like a darker black acid wash. I feel like with these pair of jeans, because they are more of like an acid wash, not like a straight up black, you get away with wearing like white tops with it as well as black. So that's what I really love about acid wash darker jeans. But same deal as the last pair. There's no like distressing on the front. It just has the two cuts on the back. These ones I actually picked up in a size 
extra small. I must have just typed it in wrong when I was setting them, all this stuff. Which I guess in hindsight might be a good thing because I am usually an extra small. So I guess I can show you guys like the size difference between the extra small and the small. And I can show you guys like how each size looks on me. I'm sure they will still fit me, but they'll just be a little bit tighter. So next up, we have a few tops to get through. Um, a few corset tops, actually, I'm pretty sure. First of all, we have this one right here, which I think this one actually has like a matching skirt maybe, maybe I'm just imagining things, but it kind of has like this ruched detailing on the front, which I really like. And it has this like button up kind of detail, button up, clip up, I don't know what you'd call it, um, at the front, but I'm pretty sure it doesn't actually, you can't actually take it off, which is kind of nice because then at least you know that it's not gonna like pop open while you're out. This one I did pick up in a size small because I noticed on the website that it doesn't have a zip or anything to get into. So I was kind of worried that it would be like a little bit tight around my boobs or that I wasn't gonna be able to get it on. But I mean, I guess I'll see how it actually fits like when it's on me. It has like this really nice detailing at the bottom here. It also has like a two strap detailing vibe going on at the top here. And this is what the back looks like. So yeah, I'm excited to try this one on. I definitely pair this one with one of the jeans that I just showed you guys just before. And then next up, I think this is actually my favorite top or thing that I got in this haul. So I got the same top in two different colors. I actually have this top in like a nude color and also a sage color as well, which I do really want to get my hands on. But these tops are so stunning. I just had to get them. I picked these both up in a size small. I do find that a lot of white foxes like corset tops run quite small for me personally around my boob area because I do have bigger boobs. I just wanted to kind of go safe because I didn't want to have to like return these and get a bigger size. Um, I literally just want to wear them ASAP. So, I mean, it might be a little bit too big for me now that I'm looking at it, but I'm just going to make it work because it is so nice i love it you guys can't really tell with the black but you'll be able to see when i have it on like the detailing at the bottom is just so cute and it does have some boning at the front as well and also in the back actually so i do think this will look really nice on it also has a dust I don't know. It also has adjustable straps and then a silver zip at the back. And as I said, I picked that one up in a size small and you could really wear this with like jeans or even just like a tight skirt, a loose skirt. You can style this so many different ways. I think these tops are super versatile. You can style it so many different ways. But as I said, I picked it up in the white as well. Same deal again. It's got the adjustable straps, the zip up back. So... I'm excited to try that one on. I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that it does fit me. I think I might actually get content in one of these two colors later on. So we'll see how I go with that. Then I picked up this little top right here, which I really want to get in the black as well. But I just love this one. Um, so it's like a high neck top. The cotton is really nice and soft and stretchy as well. I got this one in a size extra small. But what I really love about it is the... These, do you call them like garters? I think that's what you call them. I don't know. Anyways, stir up strings. I don't really know what you call them. On some websites, I've seen it as like a stir up hem or something. I think that's what they call it. <coughs> oh my God. <coughs> I'm like, there's so much fluff in the room, dust, and I'm just like inhaling it. I can see it flying around. This is not the vibes. If I don't get any content in those last two tops that I showed you guys, I'm probably going to get some in this because... I really, really like this. And this is just what the back looks like. I love this top. I feel like you can dress it up or dress it down. You could even wear this with like trackies and it'll still look really nice. So yeah, I definitely have to get this in the black. Next up, we have this little mini dress right here, which this one I've actually already taken a photo in. We'll insert a photo in the corner somewhere for you guys. This one I picked up in an extra small and I do wish that I sized up with this one because it was a little bit short on me, but it still worked for the photo. It's a really cute dress. It comes in like a chocolate brown and potentially other colors as well, but basically it's just like a boob tube dress. It has little cutouts on the side. It's very, very short. So if you're not into like super short dresses, this probably isn't the dress for you, but I know a lot of people love like very mini short stuff. It also has like this clear gel part on the inside so that it does stay up and that goes all the way around the dress. So yeah, I did really love this dress when I wore it. I do just wish I got a bigger size in it so it wasn't so short. But yeah, that's the next thing. And then the next thing that I got is just a maxi skirt, which just looks like this. So it's just like a white 
long maxi skirt and then on the side here um, there's a really big slit which connects to this what do you call this I don't know it connects to this which I think is really nice so I definitely wear like a white top with this and gold jewelry and I think that would look very nice um even like a white bodysuit I know they have some really nice one pieces which I think would look so nice with this like I wore a white one once as a top and that would look really nice with this it was the one with like all the cutouts and then like the cutout in the middle here um, and I think even that would look so beautiful with this. You can even just wear this like as a cover up with bikinis and it would look nice. So I picked this one up in a size extra small. I don't really know how I'm going to style this one just yet, but yeah, I got that one. Then I picked up this beautiful maxi dress. I'm so stoked to wear this one as well. I'm definitely going to wear this to like a lunch or something. I just think this dress is really nice and it's something that you can dress up or dress down. Like you could wear this with heels or you could also get away with wearing it with flats or sandals and it'll still look really nice. And I think that's because of the material. So it is kind of like a thick ribbed material. I'll kind of like zoom up on it so you guys can see. So it's not like that ribbed where they're super like thin and like close together. It's a little bit thicker. So I think that's what kind of makes it one of those things that you can dress up or dress down. It has like cup detailing up here. It has adjustable straps, cut out sides, and then it just flows out like any other maxi dress. I think this would even be perfect for like a date with your hair and like a claw clip with like the true front bits out and red lips. I think that would look so beautiful. Um, but yeah, you can really just style this dress so many different ways and wear it to so many different events. I think it all just comes down to how you style it, I guess. That one I did pick up in an extra small as well. Um, next up, I actually got a cord set. I feel like I, I, feel like I just said that so weird. Okay, I think it's not gonna rain, hey? So this is kind of gonna mess with my content day a bit, isn't it? But as I was saying, I did pick up a set as well. So this is the top right here. It's kind of like a corset bando little crop top. So it's just this simple nude color. It does have like very faint um, white stripes, but you really can't see it. I don't know if it's just because my lighting is like very bright in here, but yeah, they're very faint lines. Anyway, I did pick this one up in a size small. So that's a top to the set. And then these are the pants right here. I think I got, yeah, I got these ones in a size small because I wanted them to sit kind of lower on my waist. I really love the look of these kind of trousers, like sitting low on your waist. It's like, it's just such a vibe to me. But these are the pants right here. So same vibe again. It's just that cream with the kind of like pinstripe. It's very, very faint though. Like it's not in your face pinstripe, which I actually really love. I think that it wouldn't have looked good if it was super in your face. But yeah, they're just plain loose trousers. So I'm excited to try this set on and see how it looks. So I'd probably just style that set with like a pair of heels and then maybe like a blazer on top or something. But she's very cute. All right, last but not least, we have this dress right here. So I, when I saw this on the model, I'm like, yep, I have to get that. It is so nice. The top half of the dress is a little bit more structured because it does have some boning in it. So I think that will look really nice and flattering. I got this one in a size extra small. So I think this one will fit me really, really nicely. Um, and then the skirt part of the dress kind of like flows out a bit. So I just spat. Um, so the bottom half of the dress kind of just like flows out. It doesn't have any boning or anything. So I do have high hopes for this one. I think this one will look really nice and flattering on. It does have a zip at the back as well, which is basically invisible. I'd actually also get some content in this today. I might do it like in the car or something, but I also forgot to mention, it does have two little baby like slits on the side. Yeah, I'm excited to wear that and potentially get some content in that as well today. But there we have it, you guys. That concludes today's haul video. I feel like I've been pumping out the hauls like there's no tomorrow recently. I did upload two vlogs before this though and I wanted to make sure that I did because I didn't want to overdo it. I'm actually filming a mukbang Q&A this week as well. So that'll be up towards the end of this week or maybe the start of next week. I haven't fully decided yet, but yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video. I have had gum in my mouth this whole video, so I hope it wasn't out. Otherwise, it's going to literally annoy me when I'm editing this video. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!